Hey everyone, Ash here with the Better Than Yesterday blog. It's no secret that college is expensive, but there is a free application for federal student aid to help pay for college. And this form is available on October 1st for the next school year. At first, it may seem overwhelming gathering all of this information and filling out the form. But I promise after the first year, if you download the FAFSA document and complete it as you go, the future filing years will be a cakewalk. Let's dive in. Before you begin filling out the form, it'll make your life so much easier if you gather this information beforehand. The first step is to simply log in on the FAFSA homepage with your FSA ID. And if you've never filed the FAFSA before, make sure to create your FSA ID. The next couple steps are a lot of data entry. First, you're gonna start the FAFSA form with basic information about yourself, like full name, social security number, address, things like that. Then you're gonna list your potential colleges that you wanna attend. Next, the FAFSA application will take you through a series of questions to determine if you're a dependent student or not. If you are a dependent student, then you need to report your parents' financial information. If you're deemed an independent student, then you can skip the parent information step. Now it's time to report your financial information. This includes your federal income tax return, untaxed income, and your assets. Finally, you need to sign and submit the application, and you can sign electronically with your FSA ID. Now that your FAFSA form is complete, you can start planning on how to cash flow college. Follow along for more information.